This video has been brought to you by Wallop Technologies. Arcade Heroes Greetings, it's Adam with ArcadeHeroes.com and it's time to take a stroll around the Wallop booth where they had Asphalt Moto Blitz DX. This is where I got some decent footage of the LED effects on the tire there, which I had forgotten to do in the previous video. Um, but Wallop had their own booth at IAPA 2023 and that had a few products that were not found at other booths at the show, such as this Gear Fever, uh, which I didn't pay much attention to it other than to see that it's a marble pusher. And so I'm not 100% sure what the main gimmick on there is, just assuming it's that gear thing. And then you had their Crane Machine Waba show, and a new merchandiser called Karate Chop. Uh, merchandisers are generally just a simple game that you play to win a prize instantly, um, but not always guaranteed to win. Uh, here is a game that I've been interested in seeing for a while called Thunderbo Thunderbolt Shot where you fire actual balls at larger balls. And so it, your goal is kind of like air hockey, where you're trying to push the green balls into your opponent's goal. And the more of those that you can do, the more points you get. I'll have a separate video on this one elsewhere. They also had Puzzle Monsters and Skip Time, both of which are carried by Amusement Source International. I had filmed Skip Time in the past, although I hadn't seen it for a while. Just had to move around some folks there. But they also had Alley Oop, their new video basketball machine. And so you might have seen a few games like this out there. And Sega has one called All Stars Basketball, but this is Wallop's take on it. I, they might have licensed it to somebody else, but I have to double check on that. Uh, I, sh I should also have mentioned at the beginning that WAP is a, a sponsor of Arcade Heroes. You've probably seen their ads on the website there. And so, yeah, that was essentially their booth. They, oh, yes, they also had the prize shooting game. I forget its name, Prize Popper. <laughs> and this is something that Sega had, had in the past as well. Uh, thanks for watching. We'll catch you on the next video.